reading the book 13 Reads in the Five by Jay Asher. And basically what this is about is Hannah recently committed suicide and she left behind tapes um, to people that contributed to her suicide. And on these tapes she tells them the things that they did um, to contribute to her suicide and stuff, like I said. And so it follows that but also it's in the perspective of Clay and he basically was in love with her. And that's kind of what this book is about. And it just tells of the little things that, like, to me, there's not one thing in this book that happened to her that was, like, major, major. But little things that happened to the character of Hannah really contributed. And they kind of, like, to avoid a cliche, piled up. And, you know, when I um, was researching this book and I was watching reviews of this book, and just saw different things about it. Um, one of the things that people said about it was, oh, this book changed my life. This book, um, you know, really made me see things differently. And I honestly will be just straight up with you. I was like, how could that book do that? Like, I was so judgmental of it. I was just like, I don't think a book like that could ever change the way I see things. But I... I'll admit, I was wrong. I actually read it, and it made me realize little things that you say and do could really impact a person in a major way. And in this case, in the book, it was negative. But we have so many opportunities to do right also in this world, and that is what this book taught me. And now that I've actually read the book, I understand what people were saying about how it changed your life. You know, there were so many opportunities for the characters to do good, but instead they did bad. And if they just took those opportunities to do good, she probably would have been alive. And there's just so much guilt in these characters. Um, you know, and I just, I love this book. Not only was it um, a really thought-provoking book, but it's very unique in what it does um, with the tapes that's very... Um, very um, creative and unique and I just love this book I don't think there's anything I don't like about this book you become emotionally invested with the characters which is always something that I think book fans movie fans entertainment fans for that matter really look for it and I felt like I grew to know these characters some good some bad and um, I just I just highly recommend 13 Means is Why by J. Asher, and I'm so glad I picked up this book, and I hope you will pick up this book as well, and I will talk to you later.